Hi everyone. Today we're visiting the Country Club Plaza in Sacramento, California. This building we're looking at here is a former Macy's that now sits derelict. And while we walk around the outside here, I'll give a very brief history of this mall. Um, it opened in the early 60s. I suppose was mostly successful through the 80s. There was a minor renovation in the 80s. Um, things started to go bad in the 90s, and there was another renovation that downsized the mall. And the anchor stores left. This one still sits vacant. The other anchor store um, you'll see later is now a um, Winco supermarket. I love, I love things like this that get left behind. Um, no one's going to be working here anytime soon, at least not for Macy's. So we're going to head in now. And this mall, um, in its current state, is, um, well, it's something to see. just because of how dead it is. Um, you know, it's not very... Here's a nice sitting area that nobody will ever sit in. Um, it's not very, you know, this mall... I mean, if you look at it, you can see right here, it's been... There's nothing that remains from when it um, existed in the 60s or the 80s or even the 90s. Uh, but I think it's worth coming here just because of how dead it is. Uh, there's nothing in here. Um, I do like these plants though, um, that look like they've been here for a while, and um, seem to be well taken care of. You'll see how there's a lot of work being done in here, because they're currently trying to remodel this again and have people come in here to open businesses. And there's a lot of um, coming soon signs. And uh, the day I went, this place was closed. And they have a sign up here, which you'll see. You know, blaming the county. And when I see signs like this, I wonder how much of that is real and how much of it is just they couldn't be open for whatever reason. So here's a nice dead mall panorama of what used to be, I guess, um, a food court or a center court. And um, you see that family over there by the Christmas tree. I filmed this during Christmas time. Um, and they didn't have any decorations up except for the tree. And I was here for maybe over an hour. I mean, and you could walk through this mall and see everything there is to see within five minutes. Um, but the family over there had kids that were screaming and just screaming the entire time I was there. And I wanted to film this with just um, ambient sounds, but I, I tried to wake them out and they wouldn't leave. So that's the reason why there's a, a soundtrack and not ambient noise. And here's what I guess the only place to get refreshments is this vending machine. Um, you can see how much they care about this vending machine. <laughs> I love little details like this. I mean, that's just so gross. You know, I don't know how long this place has been here, but their neon's already not operational. I love this display. Um, so here, we're already down at the far end. Um, this used to be a department store. It's now a Winco Foods, um, which, if you're familiar with this store, is extremely popular, always busy, and there's nobody coming from inside Winco Foods into the mall because there's no reason to. 
and that just seems kind of awkward anyway. I mean, are you going to do your grocery shopping and then go see a movie? I, I don't know. And uh, there's not really much back here. This is just the restrooms, but I always like to, if I can, take a peek at the security area of these malls. So we're going to head back out into the mall. This is a very small mall. Um, there's just the two, well, there's just the one anchor. They're putting in a theater. Um, here's the remains of an American Eagle, I think, that's just sitting empty. Um, but if you're, you know, if you're in the area anytime soon, I would take a look at this. It's, it's pretty fascinating how dead it is inside, even though it's not really architecturally interesting um, you know a lot of stuff like this I can't tell if it's they're actually doing work here or if they're just storing things in this empty space you know there's a lot of promises being made about things coming in and opening you know who knows if that's gonna happen or not and uh, here we are back down at the Macy's looking at this um, this gorgeous inlaid stone wall which you never see anymore no one's ever gonna build anything like that ever again and I um, want to thank you for watching and uh, we'll see you again real soon